Hello, servant of Freya. Do not speak to him. Shouldn't you be moving along now, stranger? Perhaps he can help. There's no reason to be unfriendly. I can think of at least a dozen. Bad enough he's leaving behind that head. Leave us. Tend to your bird. Now that the distractions are out of the way. I have words if he would hear them. Speak then. With anger you feel for your brother. I know it well. You have a brother? His name was Demos. When we were boys, he was taken by two gods obsessed with prophecy. The gods of my homeland seldom left survivors. So by the time I learned he had lived, it was too late for amends. His anger poisoned him against me. But I never stopped loving my brother. You think my anger is irrational? You've known Freya for mere moments, and already you're taking his side? I am not taking his... No. You're just sharing your thoughts on a subject you know nothing about. An ancient! Thank <laughs> you. 
I know what you're doing. Trying to play on my sympathies in the hope I let you live. I am only trying to help. The mistakes of the past need not be repeated. I don't need to hear about your mistakes. I've made enough of my own. Thanks. <laughs> Ah! 
Everyone is so eager to advise me. As if any of you know me or what I need. The biggest loss in my life is due to you saving me when I specifically told you not to. Well, it was my family. My mess. I know Baldur wasn't perfect, but he was mine. I know. You know? You think you can even begin to understand the pain of losing a child? Yes. I do. There was another. Her name was Calliope. Calliope? What happened? It was long ago. Never mind. I shouldn't have asked. Ah! Uh. 
to that watchtower. We'll have to go through the valley this way. I know your son's story. You should know my daughter's. In the service of a cruel god, I was tricked into destroying a village, not knowing my own wife and child were there until their blood stained my hands. I swore revenge. That's... I can't imagine. I paid back their blood a thousand times and burned Olympus to the ground. Yet, the guilt remained. Perhaps you will kill me, Freya, but it will bring you no peace. Perhaps it is not peace I seek. Hmm. All those times I found you, why'd you refuse to fight me? Every outcome would mean defeat. What does that mean? I have never wished you harm, Freya. You helped us. You saved Atreus from the sick. I did not wish to live with killing you any more than I wished to die. I see. <laughs> you hear that? <laughs> Noken! And so close to the village! <laughs> their song makes their allies vulnerable! They will <laughs> not let you pass unless you destroy them all! <laughs>
I used to play hide and seek with Freyr in the crops. We'd spend afternoons stealing honey bread from the Grand Hall. At harvest time, we'd dance and feast until the sun rose. That's how so sweet. Why did I have to come back here? And be reminded of this. <laughs> The Grand Hall. It's in ruin. May Freya never waver. The other half is missing. May she protect us always. An old adage, if you will. You can get through over here! I hear them inside. Get ready to clear them out. I hear them inside. Get ready to clear them out. Oh! 
I hear them inside. Get ready to clear them out. I hear them inside. Get ready to clear them out. <laughs>
Every memory I have of home. Be glad you have a home to remember fondly. In Sparta, we were taken. From our homes as children and raised in Goji. We marched though we drowned, fought for scraps or starved. Our elders beat us till we could not stand. At night, we made our way home, alone, or were food for wolves. That is how Spartans are made. These plants behave similarly to the scorn poles we found in the foothills of Midgard ages ago. These plants behave similarly to the scorn poles we found in the foothills of Midgard ages ago.
Well, considering how Spartans are made, it's no wonder you turned out as you did. Your fate was sealed from the start. Fate can be overcome. I used to think so. When the Norns told me of my son's fate, I thought I could change it. You know well how that worked out. The Norns. The fates of these lands. That's right. You defy prophecy at your own peril. Mm-hmm. 